Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Kyle Dittman here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota. And today we're going to do a quick walkthrough walk video of a Winnebago, a 2306BH. Uh, it's a nice bunkhouse. Uh, we'll get you on the outside, we'll get you inside, and we'll see what you guys think. All right, we got open house going this weekend, so we're going to get this uploaded. If you guys hear me, we got it this weekend, uh, February 11th and 12th, and then all of next week, the 14th through the weekend. So. Come down and check us out. We got about 50 units inside. We're right here in Duluth, Minnesota, up at the airport in Hermantown. So, yeah, come check it out. Um, today is 2022 Micro Mini. Uh, I'm gonna do a quick walkthrough and see what you think. Up front here, fiberglass front cap. Really nice rock guard. Also up front, you have the two 20-pound LP tanks. This is a um, container you could put 30s on board if you wanted to. But we got 20s that we're gonna fill here at the dealership for you. We're also gonna put a battery at the battery box right down there. Power tongue jack on this one as well. We are in the back shops, so we're kind of tucked in tight, so we'll kind of get through and we'll see you. This is prep for solar on the side. It also has solar on the roof. Nice pass through storage. You can see it's finished off nice and clean. Let your battery disconnect right there. You can kind of tuck you in here. Um, you can do see there's a door, so you can store some stuff in there and get at it when you're inside the trailer. Really nice. Slam latch baggage doors. I want you to see how thick these are. Really nice. Insulated there. One slide on this unit. And tuck around. You turn on the back side. Here is the door for that bunk room. As you see right now, the bottom bunk is folded up. So you can kind of see the storage in here, throw some kids' bikes, coolers, extra storage back here where you're going down the road. Really nice, convenient. When you get there, you just pull down the little latch up here. We'll kind of throw this light on. We'll pull down that latch right there. This will drop down. You can see you have USB back here as well. Power up your devices. Also on the back corner is where your power port, satellite, cable hookup. Ladder to the fully walkable roof. Get you up there, check your seals a couple times a year. Boys, your backup camera prep. You also have a hot and cold shower on the back here to rinse off outside as well. Full size spare. You can just see the tread on these spares. Really nice. Goodyear tires. You can see these ones are pretty tight next to each other. So I'm going to sneak you down on the campsite here. Over on the back, you do have electric stabilizer jacks. Push button there. Again, dual axle, aluminum rims. Goodyear tires. Just check out that tread. Also right out front, you got power. You got a backer for a TV if you wanted to put a TV out here. Outdoor speakers. And you got the big awning. It is underlit by LEDs right up there as well, which is really nice. Sorry about that. Like I said, solar on board. Also a spray port out front. Little hose, cold water, spray off the kids, the dogs, toys, whatever you got going on. And here is the other side of that pass through. Get your solar charge up there, light. What I really like about, like about this unit is you can see the door is on a friction hinge door. And you'll also see that here's your awning arm and here's your door. So you don't have to worry about the door being open if the awning's gonna hit it. Really nice, kind of worry-free right there. Screen door. Bring it in, but as you walk in, you got your counter extension, you got power on the corner, so a nice crock pot or anything up there. This does have the Murphy bed style, so the bed is dropped down right now. Fold that up, you got a nice chair. Here's those storage doors that get you into the pasture storage right down here. You got wardrobe storage on here as well. And then I don't know if you can see it, but if you tuck down up there, you can kind of see in that back corner, you do have power and USBs on both sides of the bed up top where the pills are gonna be. You also have power up top along this big shelf. Windows on either side for nice, you know, cross ventilation. But then you do have this privacy curtain This unit here comes with a dinette, nice four person dinette. You can all fit around there. This will also drop into a bed. So this unit is sleeping about six people. You got two in the bed, two in the dinette, and then back on the bunks, really nice. 
TV, uh, your CD, DVD, um, USB, auxiliary port, radio, kind of everything all up in here. Little cabinet next door to store some devices if you'd like. You also have a quick connect for a cell phone chargers, drop that on there. You don't need any cords. Back here in the bedroom on one of the uh, bunks, you got a window up top, and then this bunk, like I said, is folded up to the bottom bunk here. Um, this unit is coming with a two way fridge with a propane and electric fridge and freezer. Uh, convection microwave in here. Um, Winnebago's kind of taking away the oven, throwing you a convection microwave, giving you a three burner, and then what they're doing is throwing you a nice big storage drawer below there instead of an oven, which I think is a really great idea. Not a lot of people use the oven, they're kind of small. Convection microwave is going to do the same thing as an oven for you as well, so kind of have the two in one with that. Nice storage above the sink. Coming down to the sink, you do have the pull down faucet. And you do have um, the farm style stainless steel sink in here. I really like these new gray kind of shades back here. You know, they almost look stainless steel as well. Give you that nice look up there. Instead of that white look, kind of really ties in with the look back there with that gray backsplash and the cabinets and the sink. I think that looks really classy. Back in the bathroom, at the corner toilet, spot for towels. Really nice cabinetry for storage back here, for towels in here as well. And whatever you got going on. Nice corner shower, some glass doors. You can see up top, you do have a skylight for your taller folks, give you a little extra headroom in there. And then you do have a corner sink, again, stainless steel sink. Um, storage below to fit some stuff. And then a nice medicine cabinet up top as well to store a couple things, so. 2306 VH from Winnebago. It's a great unit here. Like I said, my name is Kyle Dittman. I'm here with Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. Uh, this weekend and next week, we got an open house coming up. So feel free to give me a call. You can shoot me a text. 320-290-5834. Happy to answer any questions. Go to Bad For You. Get you the best deal we can. No hidden fees at Bullion RV here. Just give me a call. We'll see what we can do. And get you out camping. Hope to talk to you soon.